I got three pairs. Well, technically, one is my sister's, but what is hers is mine because we wear the same shoe size. What's up? It's Monica and welcome back to my channel. So, spring is in the air. <laughs> um, spring is in the air and I can't stop shopping. I don't know who else is suffering from new season, time to get new stuff, time to get ready. Um, anywho, I originally was going to make this video like kind of like a get ready with me but I realized that I have acquired quite a few pairs of shoes. Um, a lot, as you can see, there's quite a few over here. Um, in my, in all fairness, I have a trip coming up, um, and I actually needed some of these shoes for the photo shoots that I'm doing. Um, I have two major photo shoots coming up, one in Bermuda, one in Nigeria, and I have a few outfits that I kind of have in mind, so I had to, you know, get shoes for this and then in addition to that you know the new season is upon us um, it's time to stock up um, and just from being in this space especially in the luxury space for the last couple of years um, one thing I've noticed is that a lot of the great colors a lot of great selections sizes come out before we actually are immersed in a new season hence this is actually kind of the best time to start stocking up on shoes, especially if you are very particular or if there's certain styles that you really love. Um, now is kind of the time. Um, I have big feet. Um, I've embraced my big feet. I love my feet. I'm grateful that I have feet. Um, and my sizes tend to sell out pretty quickly. So with that said, whenever I find shoes in my size, shoes that I love, that won't necessarily make my feet look bigger than they are, I tend to just grab them and then I'm good for the season. So at this point, I would say I'm very good for the season. Um, I have, I think I'm gonna share about 10, maybe a little more than 10 shoes with you guys. I'm going to unbox quite a few. Um, I got some shoes from Hermes, I got shoes from Fendi, Manolo Blahnix, Valentino. Um, some of the shoes that I'm going to share, you guys have seen them already. And it's all about really just sharing what, kind of this kind of like a shoe trend video, but not because there are some shoes that are very much on trend. And then for the spring, summertime, you always just want to really stock up on amazing flat slides, things that you can easily wear that are comfortable, that will look great with all your beautiful colors. Um, and if you're not really a color person but want to add interest, you know, shoes that would add interest. So I'm going to go over all the shoes that I, well, some of the main shoes basically that I will be rocking for this spring, summer season. Of course, I will link everything for you guys, uh, especially, you know, if you want to start stocking up now like I did. Um, yeah, and I'll, you know, give some like, for some of the shoes that I've worn already, I'll, I'll insert some of the ways I've styled them, how I intend to style them, and all that good stuff. So, very excited for this video. I'm going to jump right into it because I don't want it to be too long, but I also want it to be informative. But yes, before we do that, if this is your first time visiting my channel, I'm Moni. I'm a fashion and lifestyle blogger based out of Atlanta. And if you love fashion, fashion, and more fashion, make sure you subscribe, hit that notification bell so you never miss a video. This channel is about fashion, but I do love to dab into home. I'm kind of obsessed with home decor as well. Um, travel, life, pretty much everything. So if you love my vibe, <laughs> make sure you subscribe. Um, what else was I going to say? Oh, yes. Also, if you guys need a little style inspiration in between the halls, the luxury halls, the fashion, the high-low, whatever, make sure you follow me on Instagram. It's odd by Monty on Instagram as well as TikTok because, you know, we're having tons of fun there. And, yeah, there's just so much content to take in as well as my um, website, oddbymonica.com. You'll get shopping links for pretty much everything on my website as well as style inspiration, home decor, um, a ton of vlog posts. You know, my blog is going to be 10 years this year, so there's a lot. And also, I decided to braid my hair um, because I have this trip coming up next week. 
I originally wasn't going to braid my hair, but then I was like, do I really want to deal with my hair in a tropical destination? And the answer to that was no, so I decided to braid it myself. Let me know if you guys want me to put like a short video together or whatever, or insert me doing the hair in like a video, YouTube video or a YouTube short. So if so, I will definitely do that. But yes, gotten all of that out of the way. Let's get into it. There's so many good shoes. <laughs> Let's get into it. Um, so yes, I just realized I did not share my outfit. Um, so I'm gonna stand up and share what I'm wearing real quick in case anyone was interested. I am wearing this beautiful, beautiful cashmere cardigan from Jay McLaughlin as well as the sweater under it is also cashmere. It's got um, these beautiful buttons. I actually did a reel on Instagram, I'll insert it, just sharing the different ways to style these lightweight cashmeres for the spring summer season. They are absolutely stunning. I love them. I'm going to stand up so you guys can see what I'm wearing on the bottom and how I styled them. Um, one of the things I like to do is I like to take classic pieces and give them a modern style twist. So I love, I love investing in classic pieces. I love filling my wardrobe with pieces that I feel like will stand the test of time. But at the same time, I like making them trendy and on trend. So I decided to pair this beautiful set with a pair of Prada nylon shorts. Let me get up and stand back so you guys can see. So I'm wearing the sweater set with these shorts from Prada. I love them. You guys have seen them in an outfit of the day video. And what I did was I buttoned the, the cardigan over the sweater and then I tucked it in only in the front and then I let the back kind of hang out. Also, I pulled the sleeve of the sweater through the cardigan so you can see the button details and I pulled it up. Um, and I'll share the, I share the look in my outfit of the day series. I did add a collar to it when I went out with them and then I wore them with my Chanel loafers. Um, but yeah, for the video, I just did it this way. Love it. And oh gosh, wait till you guys see all the shoes. There's so many of the shoes that I feature that this outfit would look great into. But anywho, now let's get into the video. All right, so I... Pretty, for the most part, I still keep most of my shoes in boxes. And the first pair of shoes that I'm going to share, I will be rocking the hell out of these. You guys have seen this already, especially if you follow my vlogs. You've seen this pair already. They are my Chanel Dad Sandals in white. I got them last year in a tweed, beigey, yellow kind of vibe. And I wore them so much. Um, I did have a photo shoot earlier in the year in Miami, so I particularly got these for that shoot. But at the same time, I also had it in mind that I would wear these so much. I'm going to insert a picture of how I styled them. I styled, I did um, a collaboration with Lily Pulitzer, and, you know, the idea was tropical, be beach vacation, fun. So, you know, I did the shoes with the floral dresses, and these are just a pair of shoes that I feel like look great with everything. White is such a great complimentary color, especially for all the beautiful colors that we're going to see more and more of this year. So getting a white pair of dad sandals was like a no brainer for me. Like this will be my go to. Um, I find that the dad sandals are pretty much are, are definitely more of a day shoe. However, don't put it past me. I will definitely wear these to dinner. I will find ways to kind of dress them up a little bit more and make them dinner appropriate, make them brunch appropriate. Um, and I will definitely be bringing these with me on my trip as well. I cannot wait for you guys to see what I'm going to style or, or what we're shooting. It's just going to be so beautiful, perfect for a beach vacation, a luxe getaway. I'm all for it. So yeah, love these shoes. Um, definitely a must have. They're stupid expensive in my opinion but there's just something about Chanel pieces that really just elevate your outfit. So, hence these were a no-brainer for me, a no-brainer for me. I cannot wait to wear these pretty much all spring summer long. So, yeah, the Chanel dad sandals are number 1. On to the next. So, the next item is a new pair of shoes that I just got from Fendi, as you can see, <laughs> for unboxing them together. Um so I don't have any, you know, previous outfits that I can share with you guys in terms of how I've styled them in the past, but these shoes are beautiful, in my opinion, kind of a must, um, and you'll see why. 
I also, oh, this is another really important thing. I find, I'm finding that a lot of brands are having discounts on new and items to encourage people to shop. Because for the most part, most people are not really shopping right now. Um, so I think it was Net-A-Porter, either Net-A-Porter or My Teresa, they were offering like a 25% off. And I used that advantage to kind of like stock up on shoes. So shoes normally, like the ones I'm about to show you, don't go on sale, especially in this colorway. Um, actually, <laughs> I should be honest, all the way honest. Um, they were having that sale, and then I ordered some things, not the shoes, and I didn't stock up on shoes originally, but they messed up my order, and then they offered me 25% off anything I wanted. So I seized the opportunity to stock up on shoes. Um, I do know there's still a lot of stores that are offering discounts right now. I just did a big order from My Teresa with an extra 15% off. So right now, is all about looking for those sales. If you are kind of like, like on their mailing list for like the Net of and the, some of these luxury brands, um, they always offer discounts. Farfetch is, does as well. So I would definitely recommend to kind of like jump on that, jump on any discounted opportunities you might come across and use that to stock up on the things you like. So Fendi, you guys know, <laughs> I'm obsessed with Fendi right now. I probably will, I think I'm going to do like a video just highlighting all the pieces that I have from Fendi and I started collecting Fendi items I think I would say about three years now and I've just been so impressed for the level of workmanship for the cost you just cannot go wrong but yeah let me know if you guys want me to do like a video on just like all things Fendi that I'm loving right now so but anywho a new Fendi piece that I just added are these gold slides how gorgeous are these so this is one thing about me, especially if you're new. I'll let you in. I'll let you guys know a little a little thing about me. I love to be comfortable. I don't like pain in my feet <laughs> at all. Um, so I always try to look for shoes that are sophisticated, that are um, definitely elevated, that will just add interest to my outfit, but will keep me comfortable. Of course, I will do a pair of heels if the outfit requires it. I'm one of those people that I will suffer for fashion. However, if I don't have to, I won't. And one thing I've found with fashion in recent years is that you really don't have to suffer. You can look fabulously, you can look sophisticated, you can look put together in a clean, classic pair of slides. And how friggin amazing are these slides they are just pure gold all gold funny enough and i'm sure if i dig deeper i might find a pair but i don't think i have any gold slides um with the shoot that i'm doing i have a particular outfit that has a gold trim so this is perfect but just other than that like these slides will look great with everything and anything i wear a lot of gold so i just felt like this would be excellent great pair of shoes clean silhouette um, I did a 41 and a half in these and they fit perfectly um, I would say I'm a true 41 in European sizes it really depends depends on the brand some brands I do a 41 some brands I do a 42 some brands 42s don't fit um, this is my first pair of Fendi shoes yeah, I don't have Fendi shoes. Um, shoes really have to speak to me and they have to be cut in a way where they don't elongate my feet. And even though these are a, a flat, they really do a good job. They're really beautiful. I cannot remember the name, the price off the top of my head, but I'll have everything, you know, the, the text overlay just running through. But I love these, like amazing pair absolutely beautiful in the gold it's in that beautiful mirrored gold then the leather itself has a crinkled finish there's actually a Fendi furs in this same finish <laughs> don't be alarmed if I get it but I'm trying to be good I'm trying to stick to my two bag per per quarter rule I kind of went oh no I don't need to <gasps> this will look really good with my sequence baguette let me show you guys one moment please See, I don't even have to buy another bag. This is excellent. Okay, yes, so I love these shoes. Can't wait to style them 101 different ways. They will look great with maxi dresses. They will look great with wide leg pants. They will look great with shorts. It's no matter what you wear these slides with, they will look fabulous. They will look sophisticated and they will elevate your look. And keep in mind with a beautiful maxi and a great bag, you can actually wear these slides to dinner, so. And I can't wait to style them in 101 different ways. So keep, not keep, so stay tuned. I will style them tons of different ways in the Outfit of the Day series. So yes.
Yay, love them. On to the next. Okay, so the next pair from Bottega. When I saw these, I knew it had, like, I had to have them. Like, I knew it would be a must. <laughs> um, and when you see these guys, they're kind of familiar, but they're different. And I love different. I really love different. So very, very, very excited about these shoes. And I feel like you guys will be too. Let me put it up a little bit so you guys can see what's going on here as I unbox them. Uh, I've been patiently waiting to unbox all this stuff with you guys. Um, let's see, let's hurry up with this. Because we don't want this to be too long. Ooh, they're so good, guys. How friggin' cute are these? So they're that classic Bottega mesh wraparound that we've seen in the high heel, and they brought it out in an espadrille. Platforms, espadrilles, they are so in right now that when I saw this, I was just like, there's no point of saying no, like it's a must have. And I'm so happy I got them. The color is absolutely stunning. It's kind of like an orangey, muted but bright, if that makes sense, orange. And they're just gorgeous. When I saw these, I was like, how would I style them? Like, what am I going to wear them with? And I thought of my Fendi first in that orangey, you know, red kind of velvet. And I felt like that would be a great way, well, these shoes would be a great way to, you know, kind of bring the bag into the spring-summer season. And I'm so happy I got these. Like, they look gorgeous in real life. Like, I am so impressed with these. And I can't wait to wear them. I can't wait to style them 101 different ways. One of the outfits that I have in mind, I'm going to be wearing, like, a green and white jacquard pair of shorts. They're a high-waisted pair of shorts. And then a crop silk white shirt and then just throw in this orangey, yellowish pair of shoes. Orange and green are great complementary colors. They're beside each other on the color wheel, and this will just look so good together. Like, I, I cannot wait to share, and just, ah, uh, yes. Anywho, love these. The heel itself is rubber, so that's great that, you know, um, they won't get ruined by, you know, water or whatnot. And then you've just got the weave throughout. You've got the mesh. The leather trim wraps around the your ankle, and I'm here for them. They are absolutely stunning. Stunning. I'm going to insert a, a clip of me trying them on because I want you guys to see how good they fit, even on a bigger foot. Um, yeah, I love them. Love them. On to the next. All right, so the next pair of shoes are my Valentino platforms. You guys have seen these shoes. I love these shoes. They have been my go-to since I got them in December. I got them December 2021. And I intend to rock these like over and over and over again. To me, these are the perfect shoe for spring, summer, especially if going out at night. I'm so happy I got them in this ivory patent leather finish because they look great with everything. They elevate everything. Every look I wore them with during New York Fashion Week was just like a showstopper. Every time I've worn them, I've gotten compliments. They're not super painful. They're not necessarily comfortable shoes because they are a 6.5 inch heel. But in hindsight, and when you think about high, how high they are, they are a great pair of shoes. I know they've sold out over and over again across the board, but I can assure you that the brand will probably bring these back again just because they've done so well. We might not necessarily see it in this color, but I know they have beige, they've got black. I would just, you know, keep an eye open for them. I will link different places that I know that have had them, and hopefully when they come back in stock, if you guys are interested, get them. A lot of people have asked me so many questions about them. I recommend these. Highly recommend these. Like, they just look great. On big feet, small feet, they look great. They elevate everything. Like... I've seen so many different people wear them in so many different colors and everyone who wears them, they just look so good. So if you want to splurge, they are very expensive, in my opinion, for heels. I remember gone were the days, back in the day, you were not paying this much for a pair of heels, but of course, years ago. Um, but you know, I just feel like they're such a fashion statement. 
Um, I'm a fan of platforms. I will have these for a very long time and I love them. Definitely will continue to rock them all season long. On to the next. So I didn't want, even though the majority of the shoes are luxury shoes, I wanted to still throw in a reasonably, a reasonable, reasonable, I can't say the word, a reasonable price pair. Actually, I have two pairs um, that I got from JQ that I love. I did do a collaboration with JQ recently and I got to pick what I loved. And I saw these sandals and I was just like, oh my God, I love them so much. I'm going to wear the crap out of them. And I feel like we all kind of like reminisce, kind of like, you know, back in the day, like growing up with this silhouette. I can't even remember the name of the silhouette. It's not coming to me right now, sorry. But how cute are these? Like, they are just the cutest thing. And I love them. Um, the finish is kind of like um, a coated, I wouldn't really say this is patent leather per se, but like a coated leather to have this nice shine to it. They are just so cute to me. I feel like this is the perfect shoe to kind of walk around with, walk around in during the spring summer explore great for travel um the soles are you know nice and firm and they won't really get ruined i wouldn't say they're they're not plastic or anything i i just the the name of the fabric is not coming to me sorry but they're just a great pair of shoes i love them if i'm correct they come in other colors but i love this neutral beige color because i just feel like it's going to look good with so many different things so stay tuned i'm going to rock them 101 different ways with j crew i tend to go down a size or i usually go down a size this is a 10 and a half and i felt like they were perfect for me and i i love them i love these i adore these shoes and yeah very happy i got them can't wait to share how i style them on to the next all right, so we're gonna unbox the next pair, and this was from um, Net-A-Porte. They are Valentino. So, like I mentioned, I do have um, I have some tropical vacations coming up, so I felt like this pair would be perfect. Um, I've kind of been on the hunt for a pair of shoes like this for a while. And I finally found a pair that spoke to me. And I feel like you guys are going to love these too. How cute. So I feel, I, I, yeah, it's coming through. So it's a beautiful blush rubber slide. They are Valentino. I love them. They've got your little Valentino Gravani on the back and then Atelier on the front. And they're just, to me, this is a great pair of shoes for the beach, for the pool. I feel like I'm going to rock these, like, all spring, summer season long. Like, on my trips, they're going to be great. I'm very excited about these. I like having, like, at least one pair of, like, rubber soles that I feel, or at least pool shoes that I feel like are very sophisticated. They're fun. Especially if I want to just, you know, kind of put on, like, that whole rich auntie thing, vibes by the pool, not necessarily going in the water, but I just want to look good. This is it. This is it. They do come in other colors, if I'm correct. They come in black and they come in ivory. But I felt like this blush pink really spoke to me. This was my favorite. And it's going to look really good with some of the swimsuits that I have this season. Um, oh, I just got the most beautiful Emilio Pucci swimsuit and matching cover-up. And I feel like this is going to look great. I'll insert a picture. And I got a discount off of the set, too. So, yeah. I just... I love I love these I love these but yes I had to get a pair I, I was originally looking at an Hermes pair but they sold out pretty quickly um, and I'm happy I got these because they fit really well the price wasn't terrible I know the price was still high considering they're rubber but they're beautiful I love them can't wait to rock them onto the next all right so next I'm gonna share the Hermes slides that I got <laughs> I got three pairs. Well, technically, one is my sister's, but what is hers is mine because we wear the same shoe size. Um, and I'm going to share all the colors, including her color. <laughs> um, just, you know, if you guys are looking, like, the color is amazing. I wanted the color for myself, but <laughs> I couldn't justify three pairs. So I was, like, called her, like, you need to get these. And she got them. So, yeah. But I'm going to share them with you guys. And then, yeah. We're going to unbox everything. I literally just picked them up. I already saw them, and I had my essay put them aside for me, and I wasn't disappointed. I knew I was going to love them all, and I truly love them. The pink one I didn't see, so there's a pink one I gave it away. <laughs> but the pink one I didn't see prior, but oh, wait till you guys see it. So good. All right, let's unbox. 
Okay. I really feel like I should be videotaping this for TikTok. <laughs> and I forgot. I'll do it again, I guess, eventually. <laughs> All right, let's see what color is in here. Oh, so this one was the one that I saw that I was just like, <gasps> they're all Oran sandals, but look at these guys, like how friggin' cute, the two-tone. I got them in a size 41. Um, I got a yellow pair last year and they were a 41 and a half, but this 41 actually fits really good. And I was really hoping it did fit perfectly because <laughs> they're, they're all sold out. Like they sell out so quickly, it's unbelievable to me. But I have to say for a luxury shoe, from all the different luxury shoes and brands that I've been you know, looking at and trying to figure out the perfect pair of slides to acquire and to add, they're the re most reasonably, reasonably priced. Like these are sick, no. This one, because it's a two-tone, I think it's a little bit more expensive, but just in the basic leather, it's about 630 and the Fendi's and all the other ones are in my Dior's are so much more expensive. And I feel like this is a great classic, but I just love this two-tone pattern. I feel like they are gorgeous. So inside you've got fabric, then it's um, surrounded by leather stitches. And then you've got the white top stitch to go with it in this beautiful caramel. Oh, it's just so beautiful. Like these shoes will look great with my Fendi first in that caramel color with just so many bags and so many things that I have. The sole is so way, sorry, not, well, it's a leather sole. It's just, they're beautiful. They are gorgeous. I am so happy I got these. I bought more than one. And like, like I said, if I didn't have a budget, I would have bought more because they sell out so quickly. And I think because they are, a lot more reasonably priced than other designer slides that they sell out so quickly um but yeah these are gorgeous absolutely absolutely beautiful i love these i cannot wait to style these i cannot wait to wear them stunning on to the next all right so let's open it up How cute are the whites? So they're white, all white, but the trim or the stitch, the top stitch is in a beautiful caramel brown and it complements the sole and I love it. I wasn't sure if I was gonna love it, if I was gonna be like, eh, but once, once I put them on my feet when I was in the store, I was just like, they are so good. I am so happy he found these for me in my 41 and a half um, and I love them, they're just stunning classic white slide of course with white especially because there's no texture to this leather it's just a smooth finish i will be a little bit more careful with them because i do want to have them more than one season and i like my whites to be stark white so i think i just have to be very mindful where i wear them to i also do have the white dad chanel sandals in white that have a bit more of a texture so having shoes that have texture are really good in the sense that they tend to mask like um they mask dirt a lot easier. They mask um, tears or like um, scuffs and whatnot. So you want to usually get shoes that have texture. Um, in my situation, these were the only white pair available in my size. There was another pair that had a top stitch that I really loved, but they weren't available in my size. And these actually looked really, really good on my feet. So I am happy I got them. I just need to be a bit more mindful just because of the type of leather that they are. Um, so I'll be mindful with them. I probably won't wear them to the beach. I'll probably wear them more so for going out or just occasions where I know that, you know, the likeliness of them getting overly dirty is a little less. Um, I will wear them, I want to wear them, and I will wear them, but I just want to be more mindful. So, you know, it cost me a lot of money, so I definitely want to get my Costco wear. But yes, I love these in white. Super excited about them. I'm going to unbox my sister's pair, um, just so you guys can see the color. Um, and, you know, if you love the color as much as I do, I would say to get them immediately because they are stunning on, number one. Um, the color is beautiful, it's very unique, and you'll be surprised how versatile they actually are. So, I'm gonna unbox the last pair of Hermes shoes and then on to the next. And no, she's not gonna be mad at me for unboxing her shoes. <laughs> like, 
It's so, it's like bubblegum pink. It's so pretty. I, when I went into the store, I wore like black shorts and like a pink sweater. So, but the, the shades were very different and it still looked amazing. Like they are so pretty. I really wanted them for myself, but I knew that I had to respect myself. And I was just like, you are not doing three pairs of shoes. No, no matter what, no. So that's why I called her and I'm so happy she got them because they are everything. Like, I love these. I love these. I love these for her. Um, I wouldn't be surprised if I give it eventually because she's in Canada and I can only wear them when I'm in Canada or when I see her. And they're so good. Like, they are so good. They're so pretty on. And they're very versatile. Don't sleep on pink. I know not pink is not every not for everyone, but you know, you'll be surprised how versatile pink is and how much you can actually wear a pair of shoes like this. They will look great with yellow. They will look great with green. They will they will look great with pretty much with lilac, with everything. I love these. I love them. On to the next. Alright, so the next pair is from J. Crew. I really love these shoes. These are another pair of shoes that I selected. And I love white. I love white shoes. Even with my big feet, I don't care. I love white shoes. It's just a matter of picking the right pair. And I love this pair. I love the fact that they're strappy. They've got the elastic kind of to give you a little bit more leeway and to make them comfortable. Then they just wrap around the ankle and your legs. They can go, you can have them as high as you want or low. I prefer having them just wrapped around my ankle as opposed to going all the way up my um, legs. And I love it. It's got a nice little kitten heel. These are really cute. I feel like I can wear this with so many different things. And at the same time too, I can dress them up and wear them for dinner and not have to wear a shoe that is so high that will make me feel uncomfortable. Instead, I've got this classic fun, very sexy with the, you know, the strappy detail going on. And I love them. They're such a great pair, very well priced. I also got these in a 10 and a half and they fit perfectly. So love these from J. Crew. On to the next. All right. So the next pair, you guys have seen these. I've shared them in a, I think in a haul or I can't remember what I shared them in, but you know, and I know when I originally shared them, I wasn't sure I was going back and forth. But can I tell you, I'm so happy I kept these. Every time I wear them, 101 different compliments. They are showstoppers. They're pretty comfortable considering how high they are. And I love them. And I just feel like they're very unique. I love the leather. I love the color. These will also look really good with my Poochie Kaftan. Mm. Ooh, I might shoot it that way. But I just have so many ideas and so many ways that I want to style these. So just stay tuned because I'm going to keep on styling them 101 different ways. But these are fabulous, guys. Like, you know, it was between this pair and that satin pair that everyone loves and everyone has. And I really wanted something a little different. And I'm so happy I went with this pair. They are just stunning. Like, absolutely stunning. I love them. I love them. I'll insert like one or two. I think I have about two looks that I photographed wearing them. So I'll insert them. But can we have a moment for the shoes? I love them. And they all like everything Versace, like this silhouette platform, they are selling out so quickly. I know this pair also comes in white. So if you want a great white pair or if you were considering the Valentinos, you couldn't find them in the ivory or the off white. Get these. These are beautiful. And they are hella sexy. They will look great with a mini skirt. They will look great with a pair of high-waisted or high-rise shorts. They will look great with wide leg pants that are super long. And they'll just elevate you. Like, sorry, not elevate you, but elongate you. They'll look great with dresses. Like, the possibilities of the wearing these shoes and how to style them are endless. Don't hesitate to wear them with flirty um, dresses, short dresses, um maxi dresses like you really can wear this with everything and anything especially with white i feel like white will do such a great job of complementing these so picture this a pair of high waist white shorts a beautiful shirt um and regardless of the color or print and just pair the two together and then throw these bad boys in the mix can you see it so good right anywho i love these love 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 them let's go to that last pair of shoes that i'm gonna unbox with you guys they are a pair of manolos and i can't wait for you guys to see them let's do it all right manolos <laughs> i love these like yeah well i love all, i love everything i purchased but yeah these are absolutely stunning
it was the color for me. This is why I really had to just slow my roll and I couldn't get another pair of pink shoes because I felt, I feel like I got like three pairs of pink shoes. But how gorgeous are these? It was the color for me and the fact that I got a little bit of a discount on them, but the color is just everything. I'm a pink girl, I love pink, and I'm always looking for ways to incorporate pink into my wardrobe. And this is just gorgeous. Like they will be on display on my shelf because they're just absolutely stunning. I got them in a 42. My green pair was actually a 41 and a half. I thought they were 42, but they're 41 and a half. And these are a 42. I love the green pair that I have because I feel like I can do so much with them. I've styled them multiple ways for you guys in my hauls, in my outfit of the day series video. And I find them to be just a beautiful elevated pair of shoes that are not necessarily too high so they're comfortable um as i go away for dinner looks i wanted to have a pair of shoes that i can wear or swap you know if the platforms are becoming uncomfortable or if i wanted to go to dinner and i just didn't want to be bothered but i still wanted to look really put together and very posh and chic they they just do it they do it they complement my feet they don't make my feet look outrageously big and they're just gorgeous to me. Like, they are absolutely stunning. They also come in yellow, and I was very, very tempted to do the yellow, but I decided to do the pink instead, and I'm very happy I did. I feel like blush is a great complimentary color, and I will be able to rock these for years and years and years to come. So, very happy with this pair. This, to me, is a very special pair of shoes, and being able to get a discount off of them was just like icing on the cake. So, I love these so much. They are gorgeous. Cannot wait to style these 101 different ways love <laughs> all right guys there you have it those are the shoes i will be rocking all spring summer season long let me know which pair is your favorite let me know if you are has cuckoo crazy when it comes to fashion and shopping like me and if you started piling up on your spring summer shoes um and you know it doesn't necessarily have to be just what you're just buying now but like even just going through your wardrobe and kind of like getting yourself organized and getting yourself ready for the season. Let me know if I'm the only one who does this or if you guys are doing this as well. Um, yes, thank you so much for watching the video. Don't forget to let me know which pair was your favorite. But let me know what you're looking forward to wearing this spring summer season. What shoes do you have an eye on? Did I miss something? Is there something that I need to buy that I didn't include? Let me know with your comments below. As always, thank you so much for watching my videos. Guys, you have no idea how much I appreciate it. Thank you so much. If this was your first time, I'm stumbling across my channel and you enjoyed the video and you love my vibe make sure you guys subscribe hit that notification bell so you never miss a video like I said this channel is about fashion first and foremost I love a great high-low mix um, for those of for those of you guys that have been rocking me rocking with me I'm extremely tongue-tied tongue today and yes if you, you know, for those of you guys that have been following me yes I haven't eaten yet so but anywho um, yes this channel highlights a lot of high-low fashion. I love luxury, but at the same time, I love a good deal. I've worked in luxury for so many years, and I do understand that you don't always have to spend the money to look elevated. And I really share that a lot with you guys on Instagram, as well as in my Outfit of the Day series. Make sure you're following that series, and make sure you're following me on Instagram. It's on by Mani, as well as TikTok. Also, I do, you know, share a lot of the high-low, you know, looks in my hauls as well. So just, you know, subscribe and then get immersed and just follow along because um, the job here is to inspire you guys to just have fun with fashion first and foremost. You don't have to splurge all the time, but it's just a matter of having fun with your fashion and enjoying it. Um, yeah, thank you so much for watching. Can't think of anything else. Um, so yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye guys. <laughs>